Okay. Future Cities competition is an engineering-based competition that happens during Engineering Week uh, here in January. Um, the basis for it is that the students are to develop a uh, physical model, um, which they're going to present uh, in their final competition. But before this physical model, model happens, um, they have to come up with a uh, short narrative to explain their model. They have to write an essay on a research topic. And we also worked on a uh, computer simulation, SimCity model, um, that happened in the beginning to kind of set the tables. For a really, really project. fun curriculum where yeah, you so. learn lots of different odds and ends of engineering and what goes into it. And I'm also in GTT, so it really enhances all that curriculum where you take you know, your design process and you figure out your problem and then you brainstorm all the ideas and you make it you know, come alive. It's about like designing a city uh, for, if, of the future, and each year there's a different problem they have to solve, like this year it's natural disasters. Uh, so every school designs a city and then they all go into one place and they just compete to see who can make the best one. Well, there's a lot of stuff that goes into a city, like on the Sim City, it wasn't just building different kinds of buildings, you had to like do taxes and uh, power and water and sanitation and police and fire and all that. Than what people think, but there is a fine line between enough planning and too much. Because if you do too much, then there's not enough time to actually get in the building. <laughs> and then just, you know, working together as a team. Lots of things around you are from engineering, and the simplest things to like the biggest things are made from engineering, and you have to appreciate it more. For a career, I always wanted to become an engineer, and technically at school, this is probably the only thing that actually kind of helps you, inspires you, and tells you the kinds of, of an engineer you can be. And uh, Well, our, our hope is that they get interested in, in engineering, um, whether it's mechanical, nuclear, aerospace, you name it. Um, we hope they get interested in one of those avenues uh, in engineering and possibly want to take more courses uh, in the 8th, ninth grade levels and possibly through high school and into college.